title today is Gaps Between Teeth. The patients that have gaps between their teeth have a unique problem in that they have two choices. They can choose braces or they can choose porcelain veneers. The trouble with braces is that if they put braces on her teeth and squeeze all her teeth together, she's going to have a very narrow smile, a very narrow arch form. It also restricts the tongue. A lot of times these patients find themselves uncomfortable after they've had teeth squeezed together. There's not any room for their tongue. The idea of doing porcelain veneers is that you can keep the arch form that you have and actually make the smile wider and permanently make the teeth whiter. The advantage to non-invasive porcelain veneers is none of your teeth have to be ground down. She saw so many people with porcelain veneers in London that just looked terrible. And so she almost didn't want to get them because they looked so bad. She found the website. She saw what I did. She flew from London to Santa Monica. We had a consultation. We started the very first day. And when she came back, she flew back to London and came back a few weeks later. She participated in how this was going to look. She could actually have the porcelain in her mouth. She could see how it looked. She could have a, a, see how the color was. So she and I did this together now. She's now involved in how this is going to look. She could decide whether she liked them this white or did she want them less white or did she want them more white or shorter. She could put her input into it and that was able to give her what she was looking for for herself. I have my own ceramist. We work on these. I work on these personally and that's how we're trying to get natural looking porcelain veneer. So sometimes in order to get the teeth proportioned well, the smile wider, the teeth the right shade for the patient, they sometimes have to fly a long distance to get it.